so today's video is a bonus video so this is going to be posted on monday which is tomorrow and the reason why it's a bonus video because obviously usually i post on wednesdays and fridays is because it's sponsored by gleaming which is a face mask i don't know if they do other skincare products actually i will leave it on the screen a screenshot of me on their website just so that you know everything and i will also link their website in the description but I have their face mask here and it's a vitamin C one. And when they asked me if I wanted to like do this video with them, I was like, hell yeah, because first of all, it's a face mask and I use a face mask literally every single day. And secondly, it's a vitamin C one. And if you know me and my channel and you watch my videos, you know that I really like glowy products. And vitamin C is a really glowy skincare product. I literally have a vitamin C serum sat right next to me here from Skin Diva, which I did a video with them as well um, ages ago. But this is the box. I'm gonna do a little unboxing in this video and talk about like the actual face mask. And then I will show me applying the face mask, what it looks like, and then like, how it kind of dries if you know what i mean so like when you first apply it i'll then do like a couple of check-ins every few minutes to see how it dries and then like wash it off and everything so it's like a full review of the face mask and the skin benefits and everything like that and at the end of the video i'll talk about how my skin feels and that kind of thing because obviously every single face mask is very different and has different purposes so we will talk about that at the end but let's unbox this so first of all this is the box that you get it's just got loads of g's over it which is quite cool because my name's Georgie um but yeah if we're gonna open it up which I'm trying to figure that out oh yeah here we go then it's literally like sitting in another box so it's like playing um past the parcel so let's get that out so it's got that box there which I kind of want to keep that because it's not got their actual brand name on it it's just got loads of G's on it so that might be quite cool for me to keep so actually I think I might do that um and then this is the actual box which has got like the vitamin c clay mask name oh it says it's got turmeric and aloe vera i think it's got turmeric in it because it needs to make the yellow color and that's where um that you know that's what that will produce it says it's vegan and cruelty free which is important to some people um but basically on here it says that it instantly enhances your skin for a lum for a luminous <laughs> bare faced glow that's very hard to pronounce um and it's stain free which is funny because some people worry that products with turmeric in them will stain their skin but this one um apparently doesn't so we'll have to see about that so like it says on here it's going to give you a glow which is obviously the vitamin c part of it um it says the ingredients on this side which i won't read out and then here on the back it says how to use so yeah, after cleansing, you use the brush that I'll show you in a second that it comes with. And it says to avoid the eye area, obviously, allow 10 minutes for it to dry and then rinse it off with warm water and to pat dry using a soft, clean towel. And then it says afterwards, your skin should be glowy. So this is the box. Really like the colors and like the vibe of that because it kind of matches like the little skincare book I've got in the background from Caroline Hirons. And then as you open it up, this is what it looks like. The face mask is just chilling in there. So that's that box, which I will throw out eventually after this video. And this is the mask. So first of all, I really love the color of this. Like I literally just love how that just matches that. Like is anyone else liking that? But I like the color of this and obviously it literally screams vitamin C in terms of the color. And then when we open it up, there's this little flap thingy which keeps it like nice and fresh. I have actually been using this for a while because they wanted me to post this video within two weeks. So I wanted to use this product a few times before filming this video so that I like know whether i like it and stuff like that and just know how to apply it properly but yeah this is what it looks like on the inside as you can see it's like a yellowy kind of like almost orangey color and i can tell that it does look like turmeric like in terms of the color um and yeah it's like just a clay face mask so that's what it does look like on the inside i am in a second gonna insert a clip of me applying and using the products that you can see how it looks and everything like that because i think that's mainly what you want to see in the video so I'm going to pop it back in the box and um, yeah, let's go to see me applying the product. Oh, actually, I forgot. This is the face mask brush. It comes with a little brush, which I think is really cute. And some face masks come with really like terrible brushes, whereas this one's actually really nice. It says Gleaming on it, which is obviously their brand name. And yeah, it's a nice soft brush. 
So yeah, this is the brush and I will be using that as well. Okay, we've now reached the time when I'm going to apply the face mask and it show you me applying it. Obviously, I have used this several times before now, like I said in the video, but I just wanted to show you me applying it properly and I'll use the brush that it comes with as well. So that's what it looks like and um, pop a little bit on the brush. There we go. And then I'm just gonna pop it around my face. It smooths onto the skin like really nicely. Oh, I need a mirror. See what I'm doing. Sorry if you can see my socks in the background on the um, thingy. But yeah, I'm just gonna smooth this around the skin. Like I said earlier, like I like how it looks on the skin as in like, doesn't that just look nice? So I'm just gonna blend this over my skin and then we'll have a look at kind of what it looks like after. But it's feeling nice and like, like gliding onto the skin. and I've literally just finished applying it and already I can start to see that it's already started to dry which isn't usually the case with clay face masks is that sometimes uh, usually once you've applied it like it doesn't start drying for like at least you know a few minutes but it's already started drying and that that is quite quick to be drying like can you see that it's literally drying as I'm talking right now um so I'll give it a couple of minutes it says to give it 10 minutes and then wash it off I'll show you what it looks like in two minutes so that you can see how quickly it dries and then um I'll um do little check-ins just to show you um but yeah I think it looks quite cool like I'm in my mirror so people probably see me with a yellow face but who cares um so yeah I will check back in with you shortly it's only been two minutes and uh, it's nearly like all dry can you see how much dry stuff there is like this whole side of my face is nearly dried up that's crazy and my face feels really tight and it and it's yeah that's drying so quickly but yeah i will see you in the full time right basically it's been i don't know i don't know if it's been 10 minutes yet but probably not quite um yeah the whole of my face is dried up and it's looking even more yellow than when it did when I first applied it. Like, as you can see here, this was the colour that it was and now my whole face is just bright yellow. Um, I think it looks quite cool. Um, but I'm going to go and wash it off in a second. My skin feels very tight, as it always will with a clay face mask. That's the whole point. And we'll have to see how my skin feels once I've taken the mask off. But yeah, so far so good. It's not feeling painful or stinging or anything like that. And um, yeah, the only thing that I can think of that could be a slight negative, which it really, is it a really negative? I don't know, but it's the fact that it dries super quick. So maybe that's a negative in the fact that you have to be quick applying it. Otherwise, half your face starts drying before you can carry on doing the rest of your face. But yeah, I'll go and wash it off and then I'll show you what my skin looks like afterwards. So I've now washed off the face mask and initially, as you can see, sorry, it's a bit of mascara. Um, as you can see, my skin does look quite glowy, like that is quite glowy and obviously I have only just taken it off. Sometimes when you use clay face masks, um, your, sk your skin is actually not glowy, it's more on the matte side. But yeah, my skin is really glowy. By the way, if you watched any of my recent videos, you'll know that my skin was playing up quite a bit due to a reaction or something, I'm not sure. Um, but I am, it is actually quite a lot better than it was then, it's fixing itself. Um, so yeah, my face masks, my skincare products have helped that. But yeah, it my skin looks really nice it feels super fresh and clean and yeah it does look quite glowy which i'm actually very impressed with considering this is the only like the first time that i've used the product um my skin is really nice and glowy which is great because i love vitamin c and the only slight thing that i noticed when taking it off oh by the way before i mention the negatives um when you remove it it comes off really quickly i love that like it literally just washes off straight away I like face masks like that because I don't want to be there at the sink scrubbing my face to get a mask off. I really like that. So that's a positive. Slight negative is that because of the yellow colour, if you spill it anywhere or get it anywhere, it will just fly off and yeah, it would just, it makes the sink look a bit yellow, but then I obviously wash it away. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. I'm a little bit messy. And also I accidentally left a little bit on my face, which sometimes that happens with products, but this time it kind of happened and my towel has gone yellow. <laughs> 
Can you see that? It's like yellow. It's also got mascara on it just, you know, because that happens. But yeah. I, that's not a problem for me because that's my fault that's not the fault of the face mask that's my fault for not removing it correctly but super happy with it what would i rate it out of 10 well so far based on how many times i've used it and now looking at my skin in the camera like i don't usually look at my skin after i've done a face mask i'm really happy with that um, so I would give that a 9 out of 10. Um, the only thing that I could say would be an improvement for the face mask is maybe the fact that it dries a little bit too quickly, just a tad, and that's it. But yeah, um, back to old me with my final thoughts on this face mask. Okay, so now I've applied the product and you've seen like my thoughts on how it applies and what it looks like when it's dry and everything like that. My overall thoughts of this face mask is that First of all, I really like how it like applies to the skin really nice and evenly. It looks like it's one of those face masks that looks nice on the skin, like when you've got it on, which doesn't make any difference to skincare benefits at all, but I just find it fun to use. And it's a vitamin C product for the glow. Yeah, it makes my skin feel really soft. And I obviously have already given my opinion, so you kind of know my like overall thoughts on the product. I will link their website in the description if you are interested in buying this and there's not really anything else I have left to say to be honest. Yeah that's literally everything. This is my overall review of this face mask. I want to try and review like other face masks in the future because like specific ones because I'm such a big like face mask user like every single day that if I find a good one like everyone has to know about it. So I do really like this one. It makes my skin glowy and soft and and it wipes off your skin really nice in terms of when you wash it off because some face masks you really have to scrub. So like I said, all the links are in the description and I hope you enjoyed this little review and I will see you in my next video which will be on Wednesday because this was just a bonus video. So yeah, Wednesday at 9am and then Friday at 9am and I think on Wednesday I'm filming a what I eat in a day video and some people have requested that I include the calories for each meal so that's what will be coming on Wednesday and yeah, have a good day and I'll see you then. Goodbye!